Right, let's get some uh, sports news. And in the last uh, hour or so, Aston Villa have introduced their new manager, Steve Bruce, to the media. He's regarded as one of the best in the business for getting teams promoted, but he does, of course, come with the tag of being a former Birmingham City manager, which won't please all fans. So let's go live now to our sports correspondent, Steve Clamp, who has been talking to the new man at the top. And Steve, uh, what did the other Steve have to say then? <laughs> Well, I mean, he's delighted to be working back in the Midlands. In fact, he joked he's delighted to be working at all, having been an unemployed football manager. But, of course, he comes with a great CV, a lot of success. He did indeed get Birmingham uh, promoted. He did it when he arrived at the club. Uh, Birmingham were in 15th in the table. That was at Christmas, and he got them up through the playoffs that season. Villa in 19th. Uh, but he's got more time. He's arrived obviously earlier than Christmas, so there will be fans hoping he can still get this club up. Well, I spoke to Steve, uh, well, it was about 25 minutes ago, and this is what he had to say. I'm delighted to be back, and really, I've never really left. You know, I've kept my house here for, for the last 16 years, so it, uh, it's it's, it seems uh, good that I'm eventually working back on this patch. Just finally, Wolves first, that's tough enough. Two more games, and then of course Birmingham City. How yeah. are you feeling about that? Well, that's going to be a long walk, I have to <laughs> say, from from the changing room up to the to the dugout. Look, I mean, you know, a lot's been said about it. Um, as I said, it was nearly ten years ago. I went into Birmingham. They were fifteenth at Christmas, fifteenth in the championship, uh, with not a cat in hell's chance, and uh, and we turned it round, got them up and running, and got promoted. I hope I can do again what I managed to do at Birmingham here at this club because if, if we do that, if I do that, then I know I've done my job. Of course, there are plenty of Birmingham fans that don't care who manages here. There are others who will hate him for it. And there'll be others who just think, well, it's good to have two great clubs in the city. Uh, but what do uh, Villa fans think? Well, of course, he'll need to prove himself to them. They want victories. Uh, what do ex-players think? Well, we spoke to Ricardo Schumacher. First and foremost, you know, he brings that experience with him. You know, I think he'll bring bring a calmness. Um, I heard somebody say the other day that he's a good man manager. Um, I mean, I haven't worked with with him myself, but um, you know, that's that's what I've heard, and I think that's what they need. So it will be interesting to see what he can do. Of course, Aston Villa got relegated last season for the first time in their history from the Premier League, and it is all about getting this club back up. Uh, Steve perhaps has the advantage of less pressure than his predecessor Roberto Di Matteo did because he arrives with his club near the bottom of the championship and you know goodness let's hope not another relegation isn't impossible so he will look to build on that and he did say uh, that he believes he's got good players here he needs to get them playing and get the results coming in does indeed Steve thank you very much right let's get a check